Hi guys, Shane here from Kiri's Mini. Uh, today we're going to have a quick look at the newest addition to the Mini range, the new Mini 5 door hatch. Um, I suppose firstly looking at it from the front, nothing has changed. It still has all the traditional Mini stylings, uh, lines and that sporty sporty look. Um, you've got your oversized headlamps, your big big grille, your front fogs and your real traditional Mini look. It's only when you come out and pan from the side that you really see the difference in the new 5 door hatch. They've managed to keep all its aesthetics by increasing its versatility with an additional two doors on the back of it. Uh, if you do come to the side, they quite smartly kept the shape by only extending it by 17 centimeters. As we take a look in the back, the biggest difference is the addition of a seat. So it actually legally carries three passengers in the back. If we look very closely, we still have two ISO fixed points for our child seats with an additional seat belt in the center so we can legally carry five passengers in the middle. It's the first time many have ever done this in a hatchback. With the new addition as well, the boot size has increased from its counterpart, its three-door counterpart, by an additional 62 litres in the boot, giving it a massive, massive boot. So you've got your folding seats, um, which fold completely flat, fitting a buggy, fitting anything in the back of it as you like. With the new five-door um, Mini continues with all the same engine options that's available in its three-door counterpart, starting with the 1.2 petrol, which returns a massive 102 brake horsepower. Okay. Now lads, a quick look inside the new Mini 5 door hatch, very same spec as you can get in its counterpart 3 door, um, you still have all your traditional Mini dials, your big big round plate centre, which your speedo actually been moved in front of the driver from a safety aspect, keeping your eyes more firmly fixed on the road as opposed to in the centre. Nice with the new Mini as well is Bluetooth is standard, air conditioning is standard, um, but with a massive array of options that you can select on a Mini. This particular one we in have dual climate control, um, upgraded seats, as you can see the nice nice tired and cross with your half leather panels in it, a different trim finish, we have a grey trim with this with a contrasting inside on it. Also as well as your driving modes, Mini being traditionally from a, a go-kart family, you have your sport mode but also from an economical point of view you can go into a green mode and um, increasing your, I suppose your fuel consumption by reducing your fuel consumption, um, but still giving you that typical mini feel, that go-kart drive that you get out of it. In front of me we have the oversized sports steering wheel, with the cruise control functions, all your radio um, and your Bluetooth controls. With mini predominantly going after the young family market in this car, um, its main selling point as well would be the 5 star rating that it offers throughout this whole range. So with Mini being a complete bespoke design, um, with no two cars on the road being similar, we'd encourage you to come down and visit us in Kiri's Eastgate or visit us online at kiri's.ie.